So now I have a non encrusted, like yep. high quality yep. hieroglyphic covered begging bowl. Yes. Awesome. I stuff it uh, back into my bat room. All the lights are off. Yeah. Uh, does it's, it, it's completely dark in here. If I push the button again, will the fire come There's back on? There's nothing. All right. Oh, my God. The levers don't work. Nothing. Okay. I immediately throw the two levers oh back man. up to the closed position. Uh -huh. I leave the room. I close the door behind me. Okay. I, like, I, the begging bowl is, I stick it back with, into my with back. With Joven, of course. Yes, with Joven. I'm not going to lock him in there. And it's like... Yeah, I'm coming. And Sorry, I was counting. I, I pick up the, 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 the plate of ceviche and, and the beverages, and I immediately, like, go back out of the room. And like you head, back, you head back out to the ballroom. Yeah. Both of you give me intelligence checks. <laughs> Is this to spot me? <laughs> Five. One. Wow. <laughs> All right. All right. This is, oh, all right. So to you. I'm too so, distracted. <laughs> right. So um, yeah, Outlay floats along behind your double, and then the thirty minutes go up after all this happens. Yes. I'm ready. Teleports. <laughs> and then he just goes screams. <laughs> teleport. And then... Oh, I'm going to scream it loud. So, oh, wait, no, I'm not going to scream. I'm going to say it because I don't want it to be like, wait a second, two people said that. Oh, yeah, yeah. So, oh, yeah, that's right. Teleport! So and then it just... Phew, wait, gone. does the mirror image make sound? Yes, it does. It okay. mimics my... It just goes... And, it just goes and disappears, and that's it. You hear nothing from outside the room. I'm going to have to wait. I have to wait. Yeah, it wouldn't make a noise floating. Yeah, but I need to wait and see if it... They're usually just soundless. ...hope it leaves. Yeah. So I need to just wait a little longer to, to see if my plan worked. Yeah. Well, if it's going to leave, it's going to leave. Okay. Soon. And search. Yes. Well, see, because the, the thing is, is, if I open up the door too quickly, it'll just go, Oh, the door's opening. You're there. I have to have it panic and search outside. Outside the building? Yes. You could just go to another room. I can't. I'm locked in this room. And I don't... Wait, how are you locked in? I locked myself in the room. Right, so you can get I out. can unlock the door and leave, but I don't want to leave that way. So I have a few options to get out. I could uh, you go through the poop hole. Oh, just identifying you. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> but I don't want to do that. I have to find out. I still have the shards of mirror. The nope. mirror shards. You, you gave those up to cast the spell to get into the wardrobe, I thought. <clears throat> okay. Unless it, says it on, unless it says it on your it's sheet. It's not crossed out on my sheet. Oh, okay, then yeah, The reason sure. I don't think it is is because it's on a second ah. inventory sheet. Yeah, that's, that I didn't that's fine, then. You don't, yeah. Okay. Follow your character sheet. Yeah. And this is the thing that shows people, but not... No, it doesn't lights. show organic material. Oh, that's right. That's right. Um, oh, so I don't know if it'll work on the metal. I can't use that under the door. Uh, tricky, 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 tricky. How can I tell if... Oh, uh, oh, fuck, what am I doing? I'm going to talk to Freya and ask... Threw Freya to Joven to check oh, outside out of the third door mm -hmm. to the right. Okay, cool. And to see if the uh, metal, uh, sentient metal is hanging around there. Joven, you hear this response from Merrick. He, oh. so Freya reports it. She's <clears> like, oh, jeez, you guys are doing some operations. So she, he's like, Merrick wants you to check outside the door to see if the orb's still there. Okay, um, I'll make my way over to where he is and see if it's still there. Okay. So as you're rounding the corner, Lalos um, has been like mingling with other people, yeah. and as you're rounding the corner, he suddenly like stops a minute and then tilts his head upwards, and then a couple of orbs go flying over to him and like hover down by him for a while, and then he sighs and then goes stomping out of the ballroom. So you make your way. So I see Lalos leave while I'm while yeah. I'm not making stomping towards down. me. No, no, he's stomping back like towards the second out, floor. Out of the ballroom, like they come and report to him, oh, no, no, and no, then. No. So you, you make your way around, exiting, and uh, head down the hallway. So as you look in the hallway where Merrick thinks the orb will be, there is no orb at all. You're clear, over. <laughs> 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 I laugh maniacally as I've outsmarted Alan. I hear you through the door. It echoes in the bathroom. <laughs> oh, oh, the garden room carries his laughter throughout yeah. the entire building. <laughs> 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 like, 
I they have a baby of clothes. Shit. This is a guest room, right? Yeah. Does it have clothes? Yeah, but not in your derelict it's fashion. Not in the bathroom. You're not in like a guest room. I need to. I oh need no, he's disguise. in a guest room that has like a bathroom in it. Oh yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Like, like that was rooms. the only way to find a bathroom is that there's you okay, know, okay, cool. Yeah, really, I just needed a room that I could go into where the minutes. sentient metal would go. He probably wants some privacy, which is a mistake. <laughs> Never do it with a privacy. Don't you dare. Well, I tried to get him, but you shut the door in his face. Yeah, yeah, yeah he tried. To <laughs> rudely, I know. And that's interesting. It can't squeeze down small enough to go under the door. There I appears can... to be limits. How is the Why space didn't you about just like open an inch? the door again? Uh, the space beneath the door? Yep. It's like a centimeter. A centimeter. Good, that's important to remember. Uh, cool, so I need to change my clothes and make a disguise. Um, Is there a will save for it? If the clothes are too nice? I can dirty the clothes. Oh. He can turn them to derelict size. Ooh, yeah. you can rip them up, pee on them. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, like, I, I figure the defining is trait is you have to smell like terrible uh no awful. there are some there are some finer things like lalo sets out stuff for his guests right well i'm just hoping that i can take off my like lo like a large cloak oh yeah there is and then yeah. put one on and then um for my hair i'm going to uh does this run off a fireplace uh no Uh, you can crawl up the fireplace to get to the roof. No, I wanted charcoal and ash. We need to get to the roof to fight Leland since he's probably Spanish. Oh, I have chalk. Do you want to fight him without the sword? I'm going to crush no. up some chalk. Oh, no. <clears throat> you're so right. I'm oh, going to crush up geez. some chalk. Okay. Just put it all in my hair. But okay. He might, he might Your hair gets really chalky. Bowl. Perfect. And then I'm going to have it go over my face a bit. Mm -hmm. And then what you else do I that. have here? Spanish is Aloe's puppet. I do not have, oh, we according to what Merrick saw. Oh. In terms of special things. Yeah, Merrick, Merrick asked Alloy if he was Spanish, and he's, he's like, like no, I'm not no, Spanish. No, Spanish is my yeah, puppet. I did oh. like three different guesses, and each time and, I was, and he like, was like, what are you talking and he, about? And he was like, are you Parallax? And he was like, I guess you could call me that. Yeah. Uh, okay, so I'm just going to go with the white hair. Um, <clears throat> is there any, like, makeup? In the room for guests? No. No? Can you describe anything else in the room? Uh, basically, you got a Ooh. singular, like, open, like, wide open dresser thing with a couple of coats and various finers hanging up. There's a four poster bed and then a small washroom off to the side. <gasps> which, which There's a garden room. There's yeah. tons of fecal material in there. You're golden. I already got chalk in Wait, my hair. what did you want I'm to not, do? I, I want yeah, to, like... Oh, derelict. Yeah, rub yeah. poop on your face. Yeah, I'm not rubbing that's poop how you get, on my That's face. how you get derelict not, fast. It's not derelict. That's just dirty. I you don't know. Derelict is, derelict <laughs> is dirty a, called poop. fashion. I'm not going to be a dirty poop wizard. <laughs> that's what you're supposed I'm to be. I'm pretty sure that's uh That's the definition. All right, well, I'm just going to have hair over my face, cowl over, different colored He's cloak not over this. everything. And then I'm going to you could be hide so away problems. the robe I was using okay. into the closet, and then I make my exit. So as you you as you exit the room and stuff, and yeah. Jobin's there, he sees you come out of the room, and you like walk out, and you're like oh it's Mary, and then you guys uh, mm -hmm. you see let's see is that possible? Yeah, you see just beyond like through the doorway at the end of the hall, you see Lalos and Dejo can see this as well. You see Lalos come stomping back downstairs, and he starts to make his way towards the observatory. Oh, he goes upstairs and he comes okay, back down. Okay, that and is. Back down. Okay, I'm gonna go to the ballroom, but be opposite of the observatory. Okay, and you know, do like the you know, cowled face away from him, mm. and you know, nobody's wearing a hood. Give me a left Fashion, hole. a way of life inspired by homeless vagrants and crack whores. That the derelict mean, fashion? Yeah, yeah, that doesn't mean putting crack shit... Crack whores. It doesn't mean putting shit on your face. Crack whores. <laughs> Mary. Uh, roll that 20. Lucky, lucky... Oh, Holy luck Holy crap. Is that luck roll or... Luck? I, I can uh, never we'll remember. Do, we'll do luck check. That was my idea anyway. Okay. So you're fine. All right. Oh, Sweet. Okay. All right. <laughs> Nobody thought the only man with a hood at the ball was, <laughs> was suspicious. Oh, no. Nobody. So, I mean, he's you're... busy. He's doing things. No, it's fine. I'm just like, nobody. Like. So, I don't like the fact that Lalos is like running around investigating right now. I feel like this is the time to get the hell out of Dodge. This, well, we haven't captured the reservoirs. No, but I, oh, I feel like this is, this is our best opportunity. Oh, man. 
God. Where are they? We have no idea where they, they are. They were supposed to be in a study, but they've potentially been moved. Okay, so right? let's, they were supposed to be in a let's study? check off the rooms you, that you You guys checked. don't know where they are. That was the you've whole point. Here, we didn't have any idea. Here. We need to rendezvous here, with our uh, with here. our associates. With Marcuccio? He, he left. Apparently. He left with the book. Uh, he got the book out of the observatory and just left. Fucker. Yeah. Have you guys checked the treasury? Well, there were no. keeper agents. Yeah, 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 yeah. They, and they, there was only one thing in the treasury. Single, okay, yeah. uh, you've done yeah. the office, mm-hmm. I've been in the sitting room, you've definitely checked the baths. Did you check the bedroom? Not thoroughly. Uh, the well, I also didn't check the bath about, thoroughly, because there was a woman in there and she uh, was naked. Did you ever check the gem room? The gem room? Yeah, there's this, uh... Why would I look for gems room. in the gem room? Like, what kind of thief do you think it's I am? It's probably in the gem room. <laughs> It's 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 gotta be in the gem room. So it's why, true, he, he, he totally wouldn't expect anyone to take it. There's and only that's two he rooms would show left. Off. One is the art room. <laughs> why did we check? The you guys have room. been in the art room. Why did we check the place. gem room? Because it seemed too obvious for I the gems to be in I the gem room. I didn't even know that there was a gem room. Until I actually now. didn't know this so, was a gem so room. So you guys are like, as you guys are like, milling about trying to figure this out. Lados comes out of the observatory and slams the door behind him. And then and then he goes. Ladies and gentlemen, I believe that's enough dancing for this evening. And he oh. like Does claps he look his hands. Oh. Visibly upset. Nope, he's contained. Oh. Oh, right. And then and then the people start moving about and like move back and you know move like into Ginger, like listening go to the gym room. Now. I, now I'm 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 gonna like look like I'm part of the service. When he mm. orders us all to stop, we like kind of pull to the okay. side and yeah. wait for his instructions. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, if you will please follow me into the adjacent room to the art room, or known as the gym room. We will be having our second demonstration. <laughs> well, wait, wait. He said, did he say the art room or the gym room? The, gym, the, two the gym rooms. Okay. Yeah. I have many fantastic wonders, and he's like walking through the crowd of people now, that I've gathered over the years that my, or many fantastic gyms that I've gathered over the years that can display a variety of wonders, which I'm sure will entice and enchant all of you. Oh, we're so dumb. So... I don't oh know whether God. or not Joven or I have, like... <laughs> what? We didn't know there was a gym room. Well, I, I also right, had that so really to be <laughs> fair, to be fair, it's really hard to read. Because it's vertical, it's, and it's they're, like... It's a display room, and then here it says gym. Yeah. Oh. It, it's also vertical, and these these uh, quotation things make it look like they're letters. Those are parentheses. Yeah, so... But the, the thing is, is that the parentheses are sideways. Yeah, so, so they look like letters. I just figured I you guys were going to read it. I really wasn't thinking that much about what's going on there. No, that's fair. So anyway, it's not, my, it's not, it's not your fault. Not it's not your fault. I'm also not that kind of it's team. Our fault. Yeah, exactly. Like, I, I usually just go to like people's homes, climb to the second floor, and steal their iPads. So people, so, begin, so people begin yep. milling into the gym room. Um, so you oh, just want to just flood be, it before, Ugh. so that we don't skip this part. Mm-hmm. I don't know what is the equivalent of like sense motive or things, but do. Either of us in the room during this announcement about showing off the gems, do we notice whether or not Katros or Zavalos respond or react in any way to this kind of thing? Like, is this normal? Do they think, like, Lavos is up to his, like, shenanigans? Or, like, wait a minute, Give me a there was ch- no plan to, like, Give me luck show off the gems. This is under or over. Uh, luck, luck check is rolling ad. Okay, I got... 10. I, I got 15. They seem to be on board with it. Okay. <clears throat> They like they don't yeah, they don't uh, act, act as if they, like, they, they join the there. crowd and yeah okay. okay so they 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 mill off and a couple of people are like oh there's three paradigms now and they start like chatting oh, back and forth everyone's everyone's like milling about like heading over yep, to towards, towards the gym I'm gonna take this chance to uh, grab your weapons grab my weapons okay. to sneak over and grab my weapons so you you slip into the room and like you know you you grab your weapons and you reach under and you pull them out of there um, ooh are there someone else's cooler weapons here no uh, like, no. no. Um, yeah, so you, you pull the weapons out and you're like, you're armed now. Sweet. Like, you have your long I've got, sword. Yeah, I've got my... But it's, but it's not exactly the most secretive of things. No, I've got my sword and my... And my hammer. Yes, and my hammer. Yeah, your hammer. But I'm, I'm saying, like, people are going to notice if you... Suddenly are armed. Yeah. Mm. <clears throat> well, hopefully, now that Zavalos is here and he's armed, and I presume that General Scipio is also armed. Some of the guards are also armed. Yeah, they I mean, wouldn't... We, your charisma might be able to get you by it, but... Yeah, know. like, they might say, oh, I didn't remember, but maybe he's important enough that, you know... Because clearly some other important people don't have their weapons taken. Right, right. So you might be able you to know, sneak through. Mm, no, I'm I'm just going to check to make sure that they're there. And okay. then put it back. Okay. Uh, okay. So they are definitely there, yes. Yeah. I, I mean, like, there's nothing good to be gained from a confrontation in any sense here. 
I'm going to keep to the appropriate behavior. Like, if it looks like the servants are also kind of filing in to see what's going on, mm -hmm. I'll do that. If it looks like they're kind of, like, hanging back and just kind of trying to peek in, I'll do that. Like, I don't want to draw special attention. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, you, everybody basically moves into the gym room, and Lalos goes up and, like, backs away from everybody. This is it, I also, is it very obvious that Merrick's, like, gone? Like, we don't know where he is? Or do we just think he's still upstairs just recovering? You guys know who, who Merrick is, despite his disguise. Oh, okay. Yeah. I will end it, but smell. I'm going to be really... <laughs> is that poop? Not a poop. <laughs> you were supposed to smell like shit. You're a vagrant. It's not... That's not what it is. Crack whore. God <laughs> damn it. See, Crack this, whore. This is what I really didn't want. Well, anyway. <laughs> All right. <laughs> no, you know what? Your smell is masked by the odor of... Uh, hands, not, it's, uh, <laughs> it's stuff like this that just makes me like not want to play this like Merrick. Why? Like, well, that's not what I want to be, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Well, isn't that the terrible cost of it's magic? A, it, is a, it is a cost. You it is a curse. Someone I who you don't will want to try be. and get rid of it. Yeah. But it, yeah. Go go on a quest to get rid of it. Yeah. You go oh, on a quest God. to like recapture your great yeah. smell. Chapter two could start off with our having dealt with this. He's now like, as the new Lord Paradigm of the city, it is time I for me to help my friend give up his smelly exterior. <laughs> if it we becomes, are going under the quest into the if it ever mandatory showers for everyone. Until then, just consider that you can do what you'd like. Okay. Sentient so metal for everybody. Merrick still in your house. What the deal worry. was. Um, so you, so you guys make all, you know, file your way into the gym room, and then yes. Lalos like breaks away from the crowd and goes, "All right, now, before he begins this speech, you guys notice this room is awesome. There's um, there's like a couple of pedestals of like incredibly rare, different colored gems, and then on the walls even there's like glass cases containing gems that are like bolted to the wall." And they go all the way up to the top part of the ceiling. This room is very similar to the art room in that arrangement. And every single one of the gyms looks different. And as you look, you even notice that some of these gyms aren't just like the standard like cut gyms you see. Like some of them are in weird shapes, like U's and Z's. Some of them look in the, to be in the shape of animals and other things like that. Some of them aren't like even gyms at all. Like you, th you think you see like the spiritual representations of some gyms contained in the cases. Like they're wavy and like translucent. Yeah. This, this sounds like the latest episode of Rick and Morty. Perhaps. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's stuff like wait. that. I'm waiting for the season to be yeah. ended so I can watch them all. Oh, yeah. I've been watching. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, I'd probably do that. Also, in the center of this room is a small little square cube with a rotating metal ball upon it. A That's, metal ball? Yeah. Well, sentient metal. Sentient metal <sighs> orb. Mm -hmm. okay. That's, uh, that, like, immediately as soon as Lalo's enters, like, Alois' face comes out of it and, like, looks around the room. Look oh, at people. It's the security orb. Mm -hmm. Not yet. Okay. So first things first. <laughs> oh no. Are the amber receptacles here? Uh, yes, give me a luck roll. Do y'all get them? Good luck rolls. Uh, he's asking. If you want to look for them too, you can. I mean, I'm glancing around the room trying, trying, to, trying to find it. Nope, not that you can see. All right. You can go ahead. Wait, and luck, luck roll is add your luck. Luck no, rolls roll under. Roll is under. Oh, roll under. Yep, I'm well. I finally you... figured out rows are under checks or plus. Yeah. You have you have no, it's not here. Ugh. Like like because because all the gyms are so unique. Looking at them all, you're like none of these are completely circular and just amber. Okay. Um, and they're in the pair, so it would right. be more easy to notice them. Right. So Lalos gets up in front of all the people and goes, "Ladies and gentlemen, allow you to present me or allow me to present you some of my most fantastic works." And he like goes over to a couple of cases and starts getting gems out. And he, like, gets some gems out and then throws them up, and they float around his head. And they seem to react to the ones embedded in his head, like they light up with different colors and Whoa. begin floating around. <laughs> and he floats up a bunch of different multicolored gems, and he goes, everybody who comes to my house for parties loves this trick. And he, like, bends his head down, and all the gems begin to suddenly, like, rotate around in massively quick succession. And they start to create a random, like, multicolors. Is he going to go, go like, is he going to go chaos mode or whatever? No, it's just, like, the chaos gems. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They just start spinning around, like, super quick. Away. And it's, like, a multicolored rainbow display. And everybody's like, ooh, yes. So it's very pretty, but yes. it's not, like, particularly, like, <laughs> oh. awesome. No, it's just like, oh, very good, yes, well, magic. That's really cool. Appreciate like, it. Well, I mean, shit. some of the nobles are like, yay. Some of the other, like, wizards are like, okay. 
Like, what else he got? Um, cool. So he, like, stops those, and then he plucks one of the gems out of the air, and he throws it up in the air, and the gem seemingly, like, explodes into a multitude of, like, flowers and vines that just go dispersing and growing everywhere. Oh, now this part I like. I love and like, and people, and people clap. It, like, throws other gems into the air. Like, there's a burst, and then there's, like, a massive, like, fire that goes, whoosh, and then gets snuffed out. Just throwing it's, away gems. And he's like... Yeah, the, are the gems destroyed when this happens? They seem to explode, yeah. He doesn't cool. seem to give give a mind. And part um, of me dies inside every time he throws one. Every time he, like, every oh time he throws one. You could buy a whole building with that. Yeah. <laughs> and he goes, ladies and gentlemen, allow me to present my next trip. And he like plucks another one out of the one spinning around his head and he goes, Come come, hand over some of your rings and baubles. Let me show you. And so there the crowd's like I hand over nothing. Yeah. <laughs> they they start to hand over, you know, some of the nobles hand over like their gold finery and stuff. And he um he grabs like this like sack at his side like pulls it off and throws the gym in the sack and then shakes it a few times and then opens it and throws all of the gym and golds into the bag and then just like whips it around and hits it down on the table and then opens it up and he pulls it out and there's this gleaming like golden statue of himself standing there and he sets it down on the table and he pulls the gym back out and you go you see it and everyone's like oh very good and then he throws the gym back in the bag and throws the statue bit in there and spins around and hits it again and he dumps all the gold back out as it was before Ooh, and he like, wow. catches the gym all right it. now that's something oh, that's that. really cool yeah so like, yeah applauding and Lolo stuff. is the best and he goes thank you thank you so he's got like the crowd entertained and he goes and now the most exciting point of the evening the point you've all been waiting for the lottery what? Where we identified the human sacrifice were victim. We, were we told about this? Uh, as you've been walking in, of course, my guards have been keeping careful track of all the guests from the list that I invited. Oh, and we uh, know who's here and who's not. So we've thrown all those into a hat and are going to draw no, a couple Merrick's of games Merrick's not eligible. <laughs> these few, these lucky few, will get the chance to be escorted up to my second floor treasury and view my grandest gem of all. People, it's going like, to be go, the oh. three of us. Oh. <laughs> like, I'm not days. on the guest list. There's no way. Unless he demands he, that no, a servant he show will, He will say... If he says my he name, say I am going to like just like, and Joe. throw ceviche on all these people and run we, for it. Like, we, we freaking sat in the observatory and talked shop in front of the goddamn... <laughs> Sentient metal. <laughs> like, come on. Wait, guys. no, there wasn't sentient metal in yes, the observatory. Yes, there were there. was. Because I thought it, it was in the corner. <laughs> uh, well, it did leave. The pyramid in the center was made of sentient metal. Yeah, but that's a whole different that's kind of sentient metal. Wait, that, that was the. Yeah. Oh, that yeah. was sentient metal. Anyway, so. Yeah, no, see. it's totally. So they bring in this, like, amazing, you know, top hat, and Laros reaches around and, you know, begins to ruffle through things and goes and draws out and goes. Zexiax the Magnificent! And, like, one of the wizards, like, steps out of the crowd and people, like, clap and he goes, thank you, thank you, Ooh. and he bows. Which, which, which familiar does he have? Oh, he has a he, little frog. He's a frog guy. Oh, oh yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love frog guy. Cool. <laughs> um, okay. Yeah. Uh, and then cool. he reaches back frog into guy. it. Frog guy! Yeah. Go and he pulls another thing and goes, Virlux the Vile! And oh, then, they're all wizards. Yeah. And then uh, another man steps into the crowd. This guy appears to have, like, pustules along his skin that he hides with wrappings of robes and people like back away a bit and he bows a bit and like hacks a bit he's got a hood over his face i know that feel are, yeah. are the other wealthy people <laughs> there kind of thinking the fix people. is in because so far two wizards in a row were picked eh it's a lottery right not right. that many wizards and what then and then uh Lalos reaches in again and pulls out another one and goes oh oh this is interesting i promise these were drawn at random merrick farrar Merrick Farrar! He, like, calls, and the crowd waits expectantly for Merrick to walk forward. Oh, my gosh. Wait, do... Are we near Merrick? No, I, I yeah. stay away from you guys when I'm in I, Yeah, I, I won't be Where is Merrick? Has anybody seen him? Uh oh oh, we're silent. The family Von Trapp! You, you told me you were trying to get away from the orb, right? So I, I know you're... And, okay. and, and Lalos goes, well, perhaps he's still up in the sitting room. We'll have some guards go check. And he snaps, and two guards hurriedly rush out of the room. And he like this, this was his ploy to figure out where Merrick went. He's to have him win the lottery. Like, he <laughs> of course he'd come. And he like and he like you know ruffles through the bag again. And he goes and he goes and Quintex the quintessential. And then another man steps. That's such a great thing. And then another man steps out of the crowd and he seems to have like a whole bunch of different pouches along his along his person and stuff. I like it. Is he also clearly a wizard? Yeah, I mean 
Nobody who dresses like that is they definitely... Yeah, yeah, they all have X's, and nobody who dresses like this is definitely not a magic. When we so, did the wizard campaign, we all had X's in our names, right? Mostly, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Except for Jake's character. Like, fucking Jake. Whatever. Um, always has to be unique. So first of all, at this point, <laughs> there's got to be some rich people in the crowd that were like... <sighs> Seriously, all wizards? I, I know. Mean, there's a couple of people who go... Draw another name! Merrick isn't here, he's left! You know, they start yelling, like, draw another name, draw another name, and the others goes, oh no, dear people, I assure you, he hasn't left the house. We will find him. Dadrio is also thinking, oh, so they're supposed wow. to be four winners. Merrick's name is really lame compared to these other people. He doesn't have, have a doesn't, He doesn't yeah. have a, I did, a title. I never said I was a wizard, though. It's true, but I now mean, we people, know, especially the, now that you're in the... The little guy said, he's a wizard, I was like, no, 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 I'm not, Mer I'm not a wizard. Merrick the smelly. Yeah, it's like, they all have like a the something, and you're like the Merrick Ferrar, it's like... Yeah. Oh. And so, Merrick the weaver. And so yeah, Malice like, goes, yeah. I'd, ask, I'd ask that these three come with me, Fashion they'll be present at the gym, hopefully we'll find Merrick along the way. <laughs> the rest of you, please, return to dancing and food and eatering. It'll be most enjoyable. Zavalas, please attend to me. I could use your assistance. And as soon as he gets to that part, I yell out from my crowd with the servants, Eatering, people! Eatering! Yeah. And I yeah. gesture to the plate of deliciousness. The people mill about you. Ooh. And Zavalas moves off with uh, I Lavos. see that as a good cover. I'm going to go over and try and grab some food. And Zavlos... Oh, does anyone pat you in the head in like a puff of like chalk dust? Like... <laughs> I don't think anyone's going to pat me. And Zavalas <laughs> moves off with the others and walks with the wizards and Lavos outside the gym room. So he's pretty much left you in here with the people. Mm. People are eating off of your tray. Nice. 